Retired police officer is grateful to be alive tonight. She says the roof of her home in Bartow County collapsed right on top of her during last week's severe weather. She spoke with Fox 5's Brian Hill about the terrifying moments she found herself trapped by debris. Edwina Wood says she thought she was going to die during last week's storm. The trees that fell on her roof are now here on the ground, but you can see where part of her roof is still dangling. There's also some bricks from her house here on the ground as well. And to my left, you can see where some debris landed on top of her car. Wood tells me her home is likely a total loss. Only by the grace of God am I here today. In a matter of seconds, the lots went out. 70 year old Edwina Wood went from watching TV in her living room to clawing her way from underneath her collapsing groove. And I heard this loud crashing and boom. And then all this stuff started falling down on my head and falling debris after she says two trees landed on her home of more than 40 years during severe weather last week. The house is located on Bishop Road near Grassdale Road in Bartow County. Couldn't move, you know, and I was trying to push the stuff off of me. And then I had to stand up in the recliner and I couldn't put my leg over it so I just had to lean and fall in it and then I don't even know how I did it I don't know how I made it to my bedroom she tells us a neighbor eventually helped her get out of the house it's really sad because I raised my kids there and now I don't feel like I have a place to live. A place would help serve and protect for 25 years. Her family tells us she was the Carterville Police Department's first female patrol officer and first female captain. I'm just very displaced. I don't know where, what to do, where to go. The 70 year old was still sore and bruised when we met outside her daughter's house in Roswell Tuesday. That's where she's staying until she can get back on her feet. If you had seen those limbs and those trees, it was, it was terrifying. She won't know until Wednesday if any of her lifelong valuables can be saved. Wood's daughter has set up a fundraiser to help her rebuild. We have more information about that on Fox5Atlanta.com. Coming up tonight on Fox 5 News Edge at 11, I'll explain what Wood tells me was the one thing that gave her motivation to get out of this house as it caved in. In Bartow County, Ryan Hill, Fox 5 News. Developing tonight.